This is a historical marker for Fort Place and the St. Joseph and Iowa Railroad along Highway 71 south of Weewahitchka, four miles south of Weewahitchka, a little town in uh, Gulf County, Florida. It says Fort Place, a forerunner of Weewahitchka, located one quarter mile east of was constructed in the early 1830s as a refuge from hostile Indians, consisted of a hewn log blockhouse equipped with portholes for firearms and was enclosed within a two-acre stockade. No remains of Fort Place are visible today. The St. Joseph and Iola Railroad, completed in 1839, was the third railroad to use steam locomotives in Florida and was the longest in the territorial Florida. It says Fort Place is a quarter mile east of here. Uh, there's a Roberts Cemetery at the end of the road, so that's probably. Fort Place was the uh, fortified homestead of the Stevens family. And as it said on the uh, historical marker back at the old courthouse in Weewahitchka, as many of the forts in the Panhandle, and there's a lot of them, they were basically the fortified homestead of the settlers and they became the uh, rallying points uh, where the settlers would kind of gather from the area to for protection during the Seminole War when there's a uh, area panic and also where the militia, militia muster there's uh, like Fort Gamble and the Gamble Plantation and other places like that the, but they are not established by the army they're more or less established by the local militia at the plantations and this is in Gulf County, Florida, part of the Seminole War Heritage Trail.